Hi, I'm Nicole Lawrence. I'm playing the girl. Hi, I'm Jonathan Adari. I'm playing the manufacturer. Uh, middle of the night is a May-December romance, as they say. I figured out just this morning that I'm the December part. It's an, uh, an affair between a widowed man in his 50s and uh, a 25, 24-year-old employee of his. They uh, fall into one another's lives. Why do I think middle of the night is relevant in 2014? I would have to say that it brings us back as, you know, human beings to just connection and what it is to find somebody that understands and connects with you. I mean, we have so many opportunities right now to be isolated. And so it's refreshing when you have this story of like, all these outside elements don't want these people to connect, but somehow they're able to overcome that. And they don't care what everybody else says or thinks. It's about what's there and what's worth living in their lives and how they, they want to spend their time. Well, people still fall in love. Middle of the night is about love. It comes in unexpected places and shapes. It's lovely because all that's at stake in the play is someone's heart, one's own, chiefly. One's own happiness, not a factory or a country or anything else. It's about people's lives. And uh, it's relevant because people's lives are still pretty much like, I mean, in that regard, they're the same. Nothing's changed, certainly since the 50s, in terms of falling in love. I believe the middle of the night is about um, finding an inner voice, uh, being dissatisfied and being brave enough to say, you know what, I don't know what this is exactly. I don't have the words to articulate it, but I know that it's not enough and I know that I deserve better. And then being brave to come outside of that against all odds at the risk of losing family, work, whatever, because you know that it's so intrinsic and fundamental for you to find the meaning of your life and your place in it. And in doing such brave things, often you find other brave people that are just as scared as you, but you get to connect and life does become so much more rich. So what is your favorite part of the play so far? Well, I have some perfectly lovely things to say to the woman I love. Uh, that's what I love today. It's very sweet. It's a tricky word. I mean it in a good way. It's a sweet, touching, earnest, honest uh, play about simple people uh, who are very complex.